It was important for 60 Minutes to give Marjorie Taylor Greene the spotlight, to ask her some questions, to show who she is. Marjorie Taylor Greene is here to stay. She's made that clear, and so is her district, and so is the Republican conference. And so long as they hold the majority in Washington, D.C., the majority is held by Marjorie Taylor Greene, imbecile though she is. And last night, you saw the hollowness of a person who doesn't read, doesn't know much, beyond the internet conspiracies, beyond the CrossFit ethos, beyond what Kevin McCarthy tells her to do. Marjorie Taylor Greene fits perfectly inside the Trump bubble, the politics of vengeance. That's what Trump is calling for. That's what's at hand. And that's what the MAGA ideology has become. Marjorie Taylor Greene is angry. 60 Minutes showed that.